After four weeks of deep transcranial magnetic stimulation, or DTMS for short, Wayne Sarles says he feels quite a bit different. Since I've started this treatment, I've only had one cycle of deep depression, and that's uncharacteristic for this time frame, so I'm very relieved. An electric coil in the helmet he's wearing emits regular pulses of electromagnetic energy to stimulate the brain area responsible for creating the disorder. The first results are felt in about five days, and soon after, patients start to feel better. In three to four days later, they said, yes, I am out of it. Yes, I am more energized. Yes, I sleep better. And I could function. I can go out. I have a good relationship with my husband or also with my wife. Electromagnetic brain stimulation has been around since 1984, but the new generation of coils allows focusing the energy to a particular part of the brain. The treatment starts with daily 20-minute sessions for 20 to 30 days, followed by maintenance sessions two to three times a week for several weeks. The only side effect is an occasional mild headache. Chief Medical Officer of the company that manufactures the machine, Dr. Aaron Tendler, says it is still hard to say how long the effects of DTMS last. He spoke to VOA via Skype. We do know that if the person continues maintenance, meaning if the person gets better from PMS and then continues some form of maintenance, meaning twice a week for three months, they'll more than likely stay better. In Europe, DTMS is being used not just for depression, but also for treatment of dementia, Alzheimer's and Parkinson's disease, and even to help quit smoking. So far, the U.S. Federal Food and Drug Administration has approved it only for the treatment of drug-resistant depression. However, clinical trials are going on for other indications such as obsessive-compulsive disorder and post-traumatic stress disorder. George Putich, VOA News, Washington.